A review committee would be working primarily with information that's provided by the nursing home records. There's not sufficient time in there for the aggrieved and injured party to have a chance to gain the information on their own. You're going to be working from information that has a high degree of probability of being falsified information. That makes it tilted at an impossible angle against the plaintiff an injured elderly person from the beginning. Um, you also have the, the issue of cost. The burden would be on the injured person to bear the cost of this investigation from the get-go. Now, looking at this case in my father's case, why would a company go to such extent to keep the truth of the matter from coming out? One possible explanation can be found in some financial figures that came out six days before the trial started. The company sold for $2.29 billion, that's with a B, billion dollars. An awful lot of money. And a lot of that money went to the top of the chain, not to the bottom. It didn't go to the workers on the floor. It went to the people at the top. 